now at 82.1 volts here on our battery terminals in the back and if we go up to the front we are at 81.8 volts so 81.8 on the charger up front here and going back to the back once again 81.8 on the LCD 82 volts on the actual 82.1 volts on the actual traction pack terminals here so for a charger built out of uh, second hand parts that's not doing too badly so we'll see when it hits the CV point how well it hits that back here at the actual traction pack terminals and we're back again at 81.8 and 20 amps of current flow 68 duty cycle and we'll head back down to the back end again We're reading 82.1 82 volts 82 82.1.2 it's about a 0.3 volt error on that now across the entire traction cable you can see we're straight on the uh, we're straight on to our cells there. Just uh, zoom back out. Back out and see the meter on there. There's no trick photographs here. There's our traction pack. Still not finished yet. But we're getting there. 82.2, 82.1 on the actual terminals. Back again up to the front this camera doesn't focus for crap you can see 81.8 just still on that there I think eighty one point eight on that charger still if we actually get into the car which we can do you see what the BMV is telling us The MV says that we're at 82.0.4.5. It's kind of dancing about a bit from the PWM. 2.5 that says. Back again. So this is at 20 amps. 82.3 now on our 82.2. Point three, point four, point two. It's a little bit, a little bit jumpy. Back up front. Try and get a better, uh, better idea there. And there we go. So eighty-two point one at twenty amps. Two point one volts. And on the pack, 82.0.4.5. So at 20 amps, we're maintaining about a 0.2.3 volt drop across the traction cables when we're on charge. The actual voltage of the charger thinks we're at is 82.1. Now we're actually at about 82.3.4. So when that's got a set point of 84.5 volts, we'll come back. And we'll see how well it uh, it holds that set point. We're starting to get towards the steep end of the charge curve here now. There's 84 volts. You should go to. Uh, I think the set point is either 84 or 84.5. We look at the current dropping back. Let's say it's the 84 volts. So we're hitting our set point. I'll now go back to the traction pack and we'll see how accurately we're hitting that point. We are doing pretty damn good. 84 spot on, 
that's just as the PWM cuts back uh, this is pretty good for the uh, charger built out of pretty much scrap parts pretty good set point here 84 volts and when the current tails below I think I have it set for 4 amps will basically terminate charge okay, uh, we're still on here there's no trick photographs Go back up to the front end. Eighty four volts. There's our current drops now below. Yeah, I think I have it set for four amps. I can't remember off the top of my head. When that drops below four amps, the charge will terminate. It's only 8-bit um, PWM on this, so it tends to be a little bit coarse. I'll run back down again and see how well we're hitting our CV point. We're a little bit low, 83.8, 83.7. Little bit low. Just now that the current is tailing off back up again I'll try and catch the point where it actually shuts down there it goes trans current 4 amps that's the contactor dropped out and we're done our pack is charged while we're here take a look at our little Chenik charger this is our 14.2 uh, volt CV point here on this charger from Chenik at $99 including PMP and it's charging our uh, Thunder Sky our four Thunder Sky cells in there now which supply the accessories and, uh, I've installed a uh, oh just a little plastic box and a cutout there just where the old battery tray was. Just install that in there. You can see we got lots of space there now that the vacuum pump is gone. That's now installed in the front tray. There's our Chenik charger. It's not even barely hot at that. This is a 20 amp um, life pole forward charger. 14.2 volt CV point on it. If you just see a little white box down there, that's where our brake pump is now installed. And just for a final little check there, we got 82.1 volts now the charger is turned off. I'll run back to the back. Yeah, we got about 81.8 on that. So that's it, pretty good charger.